The helicopter, as we know it today, was not invented by a single individual. Its development involved the contributions of several inventors and engineers over time. However, the concept of vertical flight and the basic principles of helicopter technology can be traced back to various pioneers. One of the key figures in the development of the helicopter is Igor Sikorsky. He is often credited with designing and constructing the world's first successful practical helicopter. In 1939, Sikorsky's VS-300 prototype made its first controlled flight, marking a significant milestone in helicopter history. Sikorsky continued to refine his designs and went on to develop successful production helicopters. Before Sikorsky's achievements, other inventors also made significant contributions to the concept of vertical flight. In the late 19th century, several inventors experimented with different rotor configurations and concepts. Notable names include Paul Cornu, who built and flew a tethered helicopter in 1907, and Louis Brigitte, who developed a helicopter with a four-blade rotor in 1908. However, it's important to note that the idea of vertical flight can be traced back even further. Leonardo da Vinci, the renowned Italian polymath, sketched designs for a vertical flight machine called an aerial screw in the late 15th century. While da Vinci's design wasn't practical or functional, it demonstrated early conceptualization of vertical flight. In summary, the helicopter was not invented by a single person, but rather through the contributions of various inventors and engineers over time. Igor Sikorsky is often credited with creating the first successful practical helicopter in 1939, although the concept of vertical flight dates back centuries.